What's up everybody and welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. I hope you're all having a great day. I'm having a pretty awesome day hanging out with our new Zorus, Mr. Ed, on the Crystal Isles map with our epic castle build. Oh my goodness. Mr. Ed, you look absolutely amazing in our little farm with our windmill. Good lord, this is nice. This is absolutely perfect. Now, we do only have a male, so today's plan is to go find a female Zorus and make some little Zorus babies. Do you want to have a little baby? Huh? You want a little baby female Zorus or a little baby male Zorus? I think you do. Maybe you'll make a mutated one. Who will know? We'll only find out when we get a female. Ooh, are you excited? Love is in the air tonight, my friend. But anyways, everybody. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get on our Wyvern Wyvern here. And we're going to go back to the area where I found the Zorses. And see if we can find a good high level female. And bring her back to base. Alright, so I've been looking around. Alright, well I've been flying around for a while. I couldn't find anywhere I found the last one. So maybe it was a fluke. Uh, the main issue is these guys spawn in probably like the worst possible areas ever. Ever. What is that in the sky? What the hell is that? Oh, <laughs> those are are those those are <laughs> oh those are new um uh new other uh, new thingy maboobers uh the things that you read and get you get a experience boosts <laughs> oh they're just floating in the air that's a little wonky um but yeah these guys spawn in the worst areas possible uh, it's just surrounded by evil evil aggressive creatures so they probably die a lot and that poses an issue uh i have not checked emberfall i didn't see any the first time i went through emberfall but i figure it is kind of grasslandy i guess um not 100 percent sure if we're gonna find anything in here but maybe i'll go a little bit slower because i have been kind of going fast through here thinking that i would just find another one in the same area where i, where I found the first ones but um yeah, there's nothing even here. Maybe that's promising for actually... Oh, oh, we're moving fast. Okay. Nothing. Yeah, no, I don't see anything. I guess I will keep... <gasps> oh. It's the same color as the one we found on the island. <gasps> Is that two of them? Okay, no, that's the moss chops over there. What are you? Hello. Hello, Zorus. Oh, you're a male. Oh, but you're so beautiful. Oh, I want you. You blend in so well with the background. Oh, but Frank is a higher level than you are. Not Frank, I mean Mr. Ed. Mr. Ed's a much higher level than you are. Okay. Um, maybe there's a female around here. Is there a female? <gasps> oh, get the, get, get the hell out of here. No way. Oh, they're alive here because there's nothing here to spawn. Okay, you're uh, you're not cool colored. You're just a regular zebra horse. <gasps> oh, but you're a female zebra horse. All right, it's on like Donkey Kong. You want a carrot? Come here, let me give you a carrot. <gasps> we tamed it. Oh, the taming rates are super high on this server. <laughs> okay, um, that's funny. The, the other one I found was a lot higher level. So we're going to call this one Jane. We got Jane and Mr. Ed. So that was a little wonky. Um, usually what you do is you feed it the carrot and then um, what'll happen is you'll jump on it and then you'll have to, uh, every time it bucks or something like that or starts to buck, you need to quickly feed it one carrot. You don't want to smash the E button because then it will lower the taming efficiency. Uh, so just keep an eye on that. But since you, we have high rates, it only took one, uh, one carrot, which isn't bad. Look at this. He's majestic. So majestic. But if you guys do want to see the video on actually the, the full process on taming one of these Ekus, you can see it in the video below. I'll put it in the comments. I did a full taming video of that earlier today, which is super exciting. But we want to go, we want to go breed these, these guys. Oh, Jane, you're going to make some beautiful babies, Jane. Are you excited? It's baby making season. Oh, and uh, just to verify... They can be picked up by Wyvern Wyverns, so that's a bonus. I should have mentioned that earlier, but I figured I'll mention it now. They can be picked up by Wyvern Wyverns. Because um, that would have been a nightmare if we couldn't have picked it up. Because we would have had to go all the way back to base. Like, walking all the way there. It would have taken like 4 million hours. We're going to get back to base, and we're going to get our brown chicken brown cow on. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back at base. We've got Jane and Mr. Ed ready to get their groove on. Are you guys ready? Are you ready to make the best baby Zorse ever? Oh, look at you. You're beautiful with the light going through your hair. Oh, goodness. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put you on follow. And then we're going to do enable wandering. And then we're going to put you on follow. Whoops, let's push you on follow first. There we go. Now we're using our brain space. Enable wandering. Oh, and then the sound of my people. The whistles for the sex. Oh, yeah. It's on. We're making babies. All right, ladies and gentlemen. It's almost time. We're going to see what their vinegar strokes look like. Oh, they're excited. <laughs> they did it. They made a baby. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Stop, stop moving. Mr. Ed's just like, nope, I'm tired. I'm not moving an inch. Not an inch he's moving. I also noticed while I was doing this that uh, even their little noses move when they breathe. It's so cool. Look at the little noses. Look at it. It moved. It's so cute. Okay, so, all right, gestation progress. We got to wait a little while uh, for the little baby to gestate, which is fine. So we're just going to chillax. We're going to relax, enjoy life. And just wait for this magnificent baby to be born. I am so excited. Oh my god. Okay, so we had a little bit of an issue. Uh, the game crashed and we lost our baby. So we went and got two more. We got Jill and Pam. They're super awesome. We're going to put them both on wandering. And then we're going to get them bred up. And everything's going to be perfectly fine. We're going to have two babies instead of one. It's going to be so much better. So we're just going to whistle here real quick. And I'll bring you back once we have the baby. You know what's a little weird? I just noticed... That Pam's booty hole has yellow lines around it. That is really, really weird. I don't know why that is. I wonder if anybody else has yellow lines around their booty hole. Nope. Does this guy have... No. <gasps> he does. He does have yellow lines around his booty hole. That is so weird. Oh, man. I didn't realize how big their bellies are. They're freaking huge. Oh, my goodness. It looks like that one's about to have freaking twins. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I can't wait. They're so close. It's so freaking close. They should be popping any second now any moment now <gasps> there's one right there oh there's the other one. Oh, this one's so pretty okay okay so we're just gonna name this one soft for now um because we're not gonna name them now i want you guys to name these babies so if you guys have any comments or any name recommendations below uh just go ahead and put them in the comments and i'll take a look at them and we'll name our babies we're just gonna get some roca uh, carrots on here now <gasps> oh my god we got a mutation Ooh, that is so awesome oh Okay, so I see, um, it's got the, it's fully white with stripes, and it's got the different colored socks. I wonder if that's the mutation. I just want to make sure that this one's not mutated. No, no, it's not. Okay, so that's fine. All right, but this one right here, oh, man, he looks so freaking cool. He's got, uh, I guess maybe it's, uh, because he's albino? I'm not 100% sure. I'm just trying to whistle him. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 not everybody. Stop. Stop. I just want the one. Just, just the one. Come here, Saw. I want to look at you. I want to get a closer look. All right, now that we finally got baby saw in the light, we can finally take a look at him. I mean, look at him. His beard is so freaking cool. He's got like, I think he's kind of like albino with black stripes. And then he's got the brown socks and the brown beard. It looks really, really nice. He looks so cool. Oh, I can't wait till he's full grown. I wonder if, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It's probably the albino and then the black stripes and then the white socks. Oh, and the brown butt. That's a little weird. But yeah, so what we're going to do is we're just going to babysit the babies, make sure they don't die, and uh, everything should be good. We're just going to chillax, and then we'll take baby Sa out here for a spin, and uh, hopefully you guys will have some good names for him after we post the video. It'll be super awesome. Oh, he's almost ready for his first care. Oh, I wonder what he's going to want. Hopefully he'll want what I have, like a Roka root or something, but knowing my luck, or maybe he'll want to walk. Oh, oh, he wants to walk. Okay, this is super easy. All we got to do is just walk him around. Come on. Come on, little saw. I should have probably put him on low, but uh, no, he still is on low. Come on. What are you doing? Oh, he's stuck. Oh, he's super stuck. Oh, come on. There we go. All right. You should have already imprinted by now. What's going on, dude? Why aren't you imprinting? Come on. You want to go on a super walk, huh? All right. We'll walk you all the way back here. We'll walk you around the hay bale. Maybe that'll be enough. No? No? I'm not enough? Okay. What? Do you want me to pet you? No? Okay. Okay. We'll just keep walking. Keep running in circles. Oh my goodness. This is going to take forever. What is... Why? Why is he not imprinting? What is happening? Oh my god. Come on, dude. Come on. Jesus. 
What is going on? He's, he wants the longest walk in the history of walks. This is insane. Oh my god. Okay. All right, we're gonna walk you around the hay bale again. Oh, you're lucky. You're freaking beautiful. God. Oh man, I just missed his imprinting. He did a little prance. Oh, it was so cute. Oh, I can't believe we missed it. I'll have to make sure we get the next one, but it'll be okay. We'll get him. He's looking so cute though. Oh my goodness. He's about 50% done, so we still got a ways to go. Oh man, look how beautiful this sunset is. He looks majestic. He's so majestic and beautiful. Oh, I can't wait till he's fully grown so we can finally ride him. Oh, we need to get you a saddle. We need to get you an amazing saddle, a sunset saddle. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm delirious from not sleeping. Oh, all right. He's almost ready. He's almost ready. Oh, <laughs> look at him go. He's so freaking cool. I love that so much. All right, let's see what we got here. So we did get the full 100% imprint. There we go. Yep, there it is. And then we got one out of 20 mutations, which is super awesome. I wish it would list what it is, but I'm assuming it's the albino look, or I don't know. It's super duper white, because I haven't seen one like that. But we do need a saddle. So we're going to go ahead and take the saddle from this guy. I want to paint it. Oh, crap. That's right. We need, to, we need to take it off. There we go. Okay, and then we can paint it. There we go. So we're just going to mess around with some colors here. Uh, maybe that'll look good. No. Okay. Red. Uh, let's see. Maybe this. I think that'll look good. Yeah. Okay. So let's go ahead and do that. And then we want some white maybe. Where do we want that? Uh, that might look good there. Yeah. Okay. So let's go purple. No, no, no purple. Yeah. There we go. Okay. So next section. Should we do red? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, maybe this one. Oh, wait, like, there we go. Okay, yeah, that looks good. And then, what else do we want to color red? Nothing. Maybe, okay, so let's go through here. What else are we going to turn white? Oh, maybe purple? Red? No, purple. Purple it is. <laughs> oh, we're getting a little ridiculous here. What else can we color purple? Nothing. I think that's probably about it. I think it looks good. We're going to go ahead and settle with that. And we're going to put it on him once he's fully grown. He should be almost done. Okay, we do have it in the inventory. I thought we left it there. He's almost done. He's so close to being fully grown. Come on, little man. You know you want to be fully grown? I want to ride you. We want to ride off into the sunset and be amazing together. All right, everybody. He's done. Oh, Oh, it's amazing. Let's put our saddle on him. How does it look on him? Oh, that's a little cray cray. <laughs> I like it though. <laughs> oh, let's take him out here. See what he looks like. I like that saddle. That saddle looks good on you, buddy. Oh, you need a name. A name befitting of that amazingly colored saddle. Oh my goodness. Let's go ahead and look at his stats real quick. All right, so he's got... Actually, you know what? Looking at the stats on this server would be absolutely pointless because the stats are all escalated. But, uh, man, he looks freaking amazing. I like the saddle. The way the saddle painted was is nice. And you can jump. He flies. Ooh, look at him prance. Look at him go. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. Oh, but anyways, everybody, that is all I've got for today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. I'm pretty sure we got the first mutated Equus. And he looks amazing. I'm sorry, Azorus. Or Equis or Ecus. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. But he's freaking beautiful. Make sure to leave a comment below. And if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And if you did like the video, don't forget to show your support and let, hit that like button. You gotta hit that like button for this guy. Look at him. You just gotta. It would make him so happy. But anyways, everybody, as always, I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye